How's it going you guys and welcome back to another episode of Ultimate Public Freakout. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Can yeah? you put a mask on please? I am wearing a mask. Uh, hello? Where, where is your mask? It's right here. Where? Right here. Uh, put your mask. Oh I'm my wearing a mask. God. <laughs> This next clip, a worker refuses to help a customer because the last time he was there, they got into an argument and he ended up cussing her out. Today while he was shopping, he had a question about an item and decided to ask the same worker for help and she got offended after he kept asking her why she was ignoring him. You have to deal with us because no, we're customers. No, I don't. Yes, what do you do. mean? You're no, attitude. It's it's Nobody's you attitude. Get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Why? Why? Are you what recording? did we do? Yeah, I'm recording. Okay. He got everything. Hold on. The last time he called me names and shit. Hold on, hold on. For what? Hold on, stop, stop. No, we're not holding on to nothing. Okay, we'll call PD. Okay, call them. They're looking at the cameras. We didn't do anything wrong. All he asked her was why she was ignoring him. Yeah. He likes her. Oh my god. What are you guys mad about? We're gonna leave right now and get a 24 hour trespass. Yeah, but okay, what's the problem? Hold on. Hold on, though. Can we explain our Well, what, hold on. What are you, is this from a previous incident or is this from tonight? We didn't do nothing. We asked her, what the hell we do? We need to stop recording. Why? What am I getting, what are we getting kicked out for? Hold on. Why'd you guys come running up like that? Like, hold on. I want to know what we do. What do we do? We asked for help. Okay. <laughs> no more fish. Yep, no more fish. Yeah. Someone scared him away. It's a little unacceptable, but we'll leave. In this next clip, we have a second interaction of two neighbors meeting. The first time didn't go so well as the woman being filmed who says is a daycare owner took her neighbor's phone and threw it on the grass for recording her while complaining about her parking in front of their home. Now she's back because they turned the sprinklers on giving them a free car wash. I came over one night or one day to <laughs> nicely meet your wife. And uh -huh. I said, excuse me, I don't think we've ever met. Is that when you insulted me and hit First me? Piece, I said, excuse me, I don't think we've ever met. But you hit me. I hit you? Yes, you did. I did not hit you. You had your shovel in your hand. You were ready to attack me. No, that's incorrect. I did not hit you. I took your phone and I threw it across your ugly grass. That's what I did with it. I didn't hit you yet. Are, okay. Don't you want a daycare? What do you want to do about that? Uh, nothing. Try it. I'm not no, doing anything about it. I'm not. just asking you. Look, I, I, this is crazy. You're, do I you're, own a daycare? You're crazy yeah. to come over here and, and kind of just so insult us. We all know us. all about you. You're no, crazy to not. insult us. Are you a teacher? So. No, are you kidding me? My teachers teach her kids. So we are all about them. Your kids aren't even allowed out you, of the house. Now. You two are crazy. I can they have see no one, friends. I can see no one looking way. outside trying to get out. Listen, yeah. if, you don't want, to if you don't want anybody parking in front of your home, uh. just put your barricades up because it just makes you look more crazy. Right. And we'll, we won't park in front of it, but it's a public street. We can park there. We're not well. doing any harm. Right. Okay? Okay? You don't own this. As a matter of fact, you're not even allowed to plant down here. Not, this really is illegal. Really? If we wanted yeah. to, the city could come out and make you move it. But I are you? No, are you? You're crazy. No, we're huh. not crazy. Where are you from? I think you're crazy. Are you from another country? Uh, yeah, you're I look crazy. like I'm from China, right? Well, um, a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're crazy. We will try to park across the street because we know that you don't like okay. it. Okay. We don't do it on purpose, but you don't need to turn the sprinklers on and be. Do you live here? I did live here. Yes, I did. I used to live down the street. And then I did live here for a little while. Okay? I think you should end this conversation. Yeah. I did live here before. This next clip, we have a driver who is speeding and swerving around cars in the highway and ended up hitting another driver's car and tried to make a run for it. The guy filming had just bought the car less than a week ago before this guy decided to destroy it. He goes to chase the guy on the highway who kept running away from him until he was forced to stop due to traffic and got out the car apologizing as if he just never tried to run away. Get him my car on the highway trying to leave! Get him my car on the highway trying to leave! Get him my car on the highway trying to leave! He hit my car on the highway and he's trying to leave! He hit my car on the highway and he's trying to leave! He hit my car, bro! 
Bro, bro, you're not getting away, bro. Why would you try to leave, bro? What is your name, bro? You hit my car, bro. What is, sorry, what's bro. good with you, bro? Why would you leave and try to run like that? I'm sorry, bro. Bro, what's your name, bro? Bro, bro don't touch I'm sorry, bro. Me. Bro, what's your name, bro? I need all that, bro. Bro, 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 bro. I'm, bro I'm recording all this, bro. I need your name. I already got your license plate and all that, bro. I need that. I need that, bro. Look what you did, bro. Bro, I just got this whip. Come on, man. What is your name? I need all that, bro. I need all that. Why are you trying to run off, bro? What is your name? I need something, bro. I need something, bro. I need something, bro. I'm not even playing right now, man. You just hit my whip. You keep trying to run off, bro. I'm going to follow you. Bro, what is your name, bro? Bro, you're going on the internet, too, bro. You're going on the internet, too, so what? Come on, man. You need to give me something, bro. We don't even got to take you this for. Sorry, I'm sorry. It's I not even, God, I'm man. sorry. It's not even, I'm yeah. sorry, bro. You're, how you going to pay for this? How I'm going to pay for it? This is my girl car. I'm sorry, man. Bro, you're going, bro. Ain't no, I'm sorry. How am I going to pay for it? What is your name? I need something, bro. It's not even, bro, you think I'm about to pay for it, bro, when I just got this whip last week? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. What is your name? Bro, I'm following you, bro, wherever you go, bro. I will, and I will call the police right ahead, now. Bro, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sorry. And ain't no, I'm sorry, bro. Hey, bro, calm down, man. What do you mean, calm down, bro? 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 You about to assault me when you hit my whip? No. You about I'm to assault sorry, me? Man. You about to assault me when you hit my whip? Huh? You about, give me your name. A landlord tells the tenant if she doesn't move her hot tub, she will move her out. The landlord all of a sudden decided she had a problem with the tenant's hot tub and a couple of flower pots on a front yard. The family thinks the woman is acting this way possibly because they made a complaint to her for not fixing a couple of things around the house. You are not on the lease. Hear me well. She is on the lease and don't talk to me awkward. Because if you raise to your voice, I will raise my voice. I want you to move this, I want you to move this, I want you to move everything here, okay? Well, I can't move the pop. I can't move yes, the Yes, okay. Well, I can't. Then find a place and move, okay. because if not, I'm going to make you move. Okay. Well, so you have the choice. Because this is the, our stuff. I totally understand. And um, this is not, your stuff. We're not doing anything wrong. We're because you did everything. Like, you know what we do here? We water the grass every day, we cut the grass, we plant it. You flowers. know what, Lena? This is we your obligation. Yes. We're taking care this of the This is what it is. And I... So, we're not... Have you not seen the inside? The inside looks good. Wait, what about my closet? Yeah, we're not doing okay, anything. It's all sunk in in the ceiling. Yeah. What's what's up with my closet? I need that fixed. The thing with the pop-up. We've had the pop-up. It's had been had there for like two months. The pop-up. The pop-up. Please. But I was. I... No, you weren't. He was. Yeah. Try it, please. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. The pop-up's been here since we've we've been here. You're kind of iffy on it, but you let us know. Okay. But what? And you what? Let the what, what? What did you do? You did it after you moved. You can't put me what under. What do you mean? You, it it was wasn't there. there. Yes, but, no. Yes, it was. No. Yes, yes. You, you don't have. say that. And you you no. Do. Yes, ma'am. In this clip, we have a worker who kicks a customer out for asking her if the checkout line was open. The worker was talking to a customer and didn't appreciate the woman for not saying excuse me while grabbing her attention. The worker takes the customer's stuff and tosses it on another checkout line telling her that she would not help her for not saying excuse me. The manager overheard the situation and she decided to back the worker kicking the woman out the store. Okay, are you not open? Because he said you open and he walked away. You didn't have to talk to me like that. I apologize. I, I just there. asked you, were you open? Okay. Why are you talking like that? Because I asked you a question. Are you open? Hey, but you're talking to me stern. You could have said excuse me or something like that. No, I don't think your job is to be leaned over talking to somebody else. I'm getting her. Can you check her out? Did, did you not just this throw my stuff? Please really? Get this Please get this lady. Because I'm up in the road with this lady. Get all your stuff and go over here. Back to where you 
don't play that. Don't now, you're not finna that. just throw my stuff and disrespect me like you ain't got no sense. Okay. Get out. Bye. No, nah, I'm not getting nowhere. Okay. Where the manager at? Right there. She said get out. She the one told me to put you out. So, so you told me that I need to get out because she's leaned over the counter mm -hmm. and I asked her was she open? Really? No, you the one that sent me over here said she open. Come on, sir. You sitting up, you want to insult me, and you making minimum wage? Really? I have really? no kids. Look I at you. You people. sitting up insulting me? You going to sit up and insult me? Really? Ma'am, can you please step out the I'm not going to put my hands on you. Can you just step out, ma'am? I'm asking respectfully. Now, your employee going to throw my stuff. Ma'am, she going to throw my she stuff. She will have disciplinary actions. I'm asking you, can you come down with Just me? like I'm she saying. Out, she going to throw. All I did was ask her, are you open? Are you going to talk to me like that? I got it all on video because I hit record because I knew she was going to get ignorant. You started yelling. She leaving leaving like this. Ma'am, uh, uh, I need your number. I, yes, ma'am. I was getting uh -oh. my number. Thank you very just much. Just like I asked you a question. Just like she asked you to get I asked you a question. Right. Then you turn around, pick my stuff up, and you do it, ma'am. Can like you ignorant, really? Ma'am, I'm asking you respectfully. Really? Can you step out? Yeah, I'ma step out. What? What's? What's Corbin's number? What's Corbin? Give me a card, a number, whatever. Give it to me now. Need to learn how to shut up. Make me. Just like I said, you need to learn how to shut up or get another job. Get another job. I see they hire. I see they hire anybody. All you have to do is answer a question, yes or no. If you were open, then you're going to cop an attitude? Really? Yeah. Ignorance. In this last clip, we have a worker at a Costco who kicks a customer out for asking him a question. The guy felt the worker mistreated his wife while trying to grab ID to enter Costco. The worker felt offended with his question and decided to kick him out until the manager arrived and handled the situation just like a manager should. Sir, I'm ask, I've asked you to stop recording numerous Please. times. It's against I'm, my rights. I'm asking, Thank you for leaving. I'm asking you a day. question. I'm okay, simply, sir, I've answered your question. No, you I have me? every right to record. This is a public place. Are you, this is not a public this place. This is how I'm being treated. Private, so I have, the right to, I have the right to answer, sir, to get please, answered please. to my question. You have the right to leave the building please, now, sir. Please, please. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Please. Okay. Please. Okay. Please. What's going on? This is, how, this is how you treat your members, right? You call the police on your members and your colleague pointed to another colleague to keep an eye on her because now? She, right now right okay. now because she did she wanted to get id over here okay and she said they they said keep an eye on her do we look look like thieves no no i think maybe it was to go to membership but yeah but and we chris, weren't discriminating chris, against you. chris chris was just justifying that behavior and and he said we do that to every other customer Okay. We make sure is members that go to membership and they said they're going to go to membership. That's what I said, sir. I and you, you, keep an, you, you tell somebody else to keep an eye on them? Isn't that, isn't that disrespectful okay. of them? Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, uh, I'm done, me, okay. So, what, so is she in there now shopping? No, she's outside. She, okay, well I apologize <laughs> about that, but we did not... It wasn't discrimination by any means. I think maybe it was just to make sure that you guys went to membership. I, I highly doubt it. Yeah. If, if, if we were white people, we would, be, we would be treated like that. We have never been treated like that. And Costco, out of all places, I, I never expected that like that. Okay. Well, I apologize, and I'll definitely speak with him about that. But it wasn't it wasn't meant in that just the, in that area. Is that really the type of behavior you? No, we don't. So I'll I'll, chat, I'll talk with him and, and discuss that with him. But I mean, I don't want you to think that we're discriminating against you. So I apologize about that. Did you get to shop? I did. I okay. did. All right. Thank well, you so much. Again. And that wraps up this episode of Ultimate Public Freakouts. Thank you for watching. Make sure to hit that thumbs up, and I will see you next time. You said all I need is a mask. One second for me, sure. um, So you can check my ID? I need to take your helmet off first. Yeah, to see my ID? No, you have to take your helmet off and just have your mask on inside this building. What? Where does it say that? Sir, do you want service here tonight? I have rules and protocols I have to follow. Your rules are that I have to take off my helmet? Yes, sir. Where? Just tell me.